be be tagging this. Like, yeah, like this court, like this quarter, my schedule is actually pretty late. Cause like I wake up and my first class is 1:30 p.m. I don't have to wake up for morning at all. Either I can wake up in the morning and just focus on like either met homework or study or met games. Yeah, this yeah, this match could be a Kotsky and Ponon. So this is literally like mid tier versus top tier, right? I'm I didn't uh from what I heard from Justin, Ponon isn't actually top tier. She's like high. So she's high up there, but she's not the top tier. Okay. Uh from what I heard the top tier is um, Seth. Okay. Actually no, I think yeah. No, Phonon, yeah. Phonon is... Phonon, Seth, and... Uh, what is her name? Oh, nice. So, so Batista has scary zoning. And on top of her yeah. play capabilities, it's weird. Yeah. So, uh, go to the game, the starting. Uh, device is not available. Oh, I, why? I'm sure no one's getting bodied right now. Oh, well. So, starting off, alright. So, pretty even. So... Uh, in my opinion, this matchup is really just Aikoski is able to get in, stay in, or she loses. That seems about right. Because, yeah, Phonon has a lot of zoning capabilities and able to do a really, like, lots of pressure from pretty much across the screen. Absolutely. But oh, that was a bad wake up out of pressure, though. Yeah. Ooh. Respect the DP! Yeah, Respect the DP! Yeah, just get it. Respect the DP! What is this? He says that a lot, doesn't he? Yeah. Like, the past couple games we've streamed, like, we've just seen players that have no respect at all. Uh, <laughs> respect, what's that? Yeah. This is a tournament, I want to win. Exactly, I just want to be in some space and give away all my games to winning. But yeah. Okay. Alright, so he's got it, he's got him on this nice little, little combo, dropped it, of course. There we go. Yeah, okay. Yeah, just keep him out. Yeah. There's no reason to commit with anything. Just try to keep him out. You don't even have to jump that much. Like, he's, yeah. he's doing something to, like, interrupt you, but, okay, nice. Get a good combo. Ooh. There we go. That's a lot of damage. Yeah, Phonon can do a lot close range too. Holy shit. Yeah, like Akatsuki, Akatsuki's only projectile potential isn't really that great either. Yeah, to it interrupts her, but it looks like if like she's farther away, yeah. So why is she not doing that ground one? And it's his only way to get in really. Why is he lagging like that? I don't know. That's really bizarre. Alright. Strength so, problems? I don't know. Yeah, ooh, he just wanted to get in. Did he just wait here for him to approach him? All yeah, right. Narukami's playing a keep away character, like he wants to get in. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's because Photon Phonon still has has like crazy potential close range too. Yeah, but like, I that, mean I mean that's why Batista is also top tier. She just has scary zoning too, but yeah, she has combos. Yeah, but I mean if you're wait, <laughs> Yo, that was 2k off of like a long poke. <laughs> I think I think her potential is fine. Just keep just keep them out. All right, you're just resetting a bunch. You know what to do. Oh, uh, <laughs> fair DP, enough. Come He's on. gonna do that at some point. He's just seen so, that yeah. coming. He got he really used chain shifts. Oh, uh, he got punished anyway. Well, yeah, like. Ooh, CS wow. is kind of is very different from like rapid canceling because like yeah. you only get like one frame of invincibility or like oh, yeah. wow, and that's about it. That, yeah. Is he gonna take the round? He takes the round. Yeah, the problem with Narukami, at least he mentioned this, is that if someone DPs and not respectful to him, it like it like really freaks him out for some reason. What? Wait, what? Like if like he told me that the reason that he's lost like one tiny star or whatever was because he was just not being respectful. Like, oh like, yeah. Uh, and it's like you have to just expect that, man. Yeah, like, at, at this point, after this tournament, I'm just expecting everything, like every type of player, player's play style, no matter how jank it is. Good. Just expect them to kill themselves. Like, yeah. like he could kill him a lot more if he just waited. Okay, nice instant overhead. There we go. He dropped it, of course, because I died in that game very much. It does not look like he, like, he looks like he remembers some stuff. But other than that, yeah, everyone, both everyone just dropping stuff. This is definitely like This a, is just neutral. Yeah. It's this is how under neutral works. It pretty much is. Actually, every game. They just try to, like, do a move and see if it hits. <laughs> Please. That's it. <laughs> Please. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Good way to start off a round. Oh. Uh, yeah, his jumping just whiffed and he was just like, oh. first. Okay. Don't know why he did that, but it worked. Yeah, this range, it looks like it looks terrible for her. What is she gonna do? Okay. That. That was a bad idea. <laughs> It would be terrible. I didn't know you why you go for that in your meeting. It's like starting some meet off with a DP. What? Yeah. yeah, it looks like that just interrupted because it was probably like super fast. 
Yeah. Ooh, that beat that, that took the GC. That took the Akatsi out. can't even do his only zoning potential mid range well, because it's phone on. Hey man. Oh my god. Imagine if he imagine if he can read the projectile. Oh nice. Akujumo with one one. He just kinda kept staying in there and then just jabbed him on his way yeah. up and he won. That's how Akatsuki honestly worked, because his low is kind of is actually really good. Well, yeah, but Narukam is just kind of letting him in. Like I his like, like yeah. Akatsuki's low jab is actually like pretty decent. Because oh, it like it's great. multi hitting and, yeah. it, and all of it hits low. Yeah, and then it's also good stagger pressure in a game that you can reverse beat. Stagger pressure in this game is terrifying, just because of the fact you can start off like a big button and then you can go to like a medium button or like a smaller button and you're still like expecting another hit. What was that? Yeah, that's I'm what just... I'm talking about. Stop jumping. No, like, like if, okay, like, that was good. Like he was going to do his projectile, but he charged instead, so he Ooh. took the hit because oh. it takes you know more startle. That sucks. Okay, nice. He's getting something. Chain going. shifts. Yeah, keeping him out. Let it. Let just let him try to approach. Okay. Yeah, that's, that was that's, actually that's good the jumping. literal play style of zoner. Just constantly like just use like projectiles yeah. until they get annoyed and try to do risky um approaches and Absolutely. then punish him for it. Yeah, and I mean he's pulling doing, up tier list. Yeah, and now he's doing the right thing. I think we talked Hide about it. a plus. Oh yeah, yeah, yep. Yeah. Oh, you looked up. This is Brett. That guy's good. I mean, it's better than event hubs. All right. Anyway, we get back to the game. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah. This is yeah, this is looking pretty, pretty yeah. good for Nawakami. Yeah. He, he's understanding the character's play style again. <laughs> <laughs> better play. Is that M tier? Oh wait. <laughs> M. M. Yeah, he's I don't see. I don't. Bottom. Nice. Holly Vader.